Here's the paradox. The more efficient and capable this infrastructure becomes, the cheaper and more accessible AI systems get, which then drives even higher demand for compute, power and cooling. That's Jevons' paradox in action. The more efficient you make a resource, the more it ends up being used. And this efficiency comes at an environmental cost. AI is energy intensive. According to the International Energy Agency, global data center and electricity demand is already in the hundreds of terawatt hours. The US alone produces over 105 million tons of CO2 equivalent each year from data centers. That's around 2% of national emissions. Morgan Stanley projects emissions could reach 2.5 billion tons of CO2 by 2030. But it's not just carbon. Water use is an emerging issue too. Some of the data centers consume up to 5 million gallons of drinking water a day, often in water-stressed regions, and many rely on cooling systems that use chemicals and forever compounds, which risk contaminating local water cycles. So when you run a big model or fire an agent up, you're tapping into a global chain of electricity, cooling, mining, and emissions. The footprint is real.